I was taking care of my daughter and I woke up that morning, um, my neck, my back, I mean down into my shoulders and my jaws absolutely felt like somebody was pulling my teeth. So she said, Mother, you don't look, your color doesn't look right. And evidently I had looked it up and it could have been the symptoms of a heart attack for women. So she called John and he took me to the local hospital and I don't know what kind of test they did, but they realized they evidently were not able to handle the situation and were gonna airlift me. But it was real bad weather that day, so they decided to do it by ambulance. Brought me down here and as I understand it, the surgical team was ready. I was told that I had a uh, aorta dissection and then that I had a cardiac arrest during the surgery and they healed it, replaced the valve. You know, I, I didn't even know he was my surgeon until I got home and then a month later we came back to get my clamps out and I saw him in the uh, hallway. Still didn't know how I knew him except by those commercials on TV and then his assistant had told me he was my surgeon. But, you know, I had no idea he was a great surgeon, a bad surgeon, whatever. Um, but evidently he is a super surgeon because I understand you really don't live through the, you know, most people don't live through the kind of surgery that I had. So.